Hi everybody, it's David from Red Wagon Dioramas. Today I'm going to share some footage of me painting the walls for my Death Star trash compactor diorama. This is just a black acrylic base coat over the foam board. The idea here is uh, to get the paint down inside all the grooves and to give a protective layer uh, for the next coat of spray paint that I'm going to use. Sometimes the spray paint will uh, affect the foam. So it's good to put a base coat over it beforehand. Now here's a real light application of gray spray paint. This is just a Krylon paint from I got from Lowe's. Just to get kind of that Death Star gray as a base color. I'm not going too heavy. I'm trying to leave the black in all the grooves there. And after that, I started with a series of real watery acrylic washes, starting with this really orangish brown, rusty color here. I'm working off still images from the movie, trying to match the color and the, the variation that you see in the film. This was a little bright for me, so I decided to darken it up a little bit. Got a little, added some black into the mix. Again, went really heavy on the horizontal rails there. Uh, just letting the, the paint really just run down the side of the wall. Lots and lots of water. And it's okay for the colors to, you know, kind of blend and mix together or something like this. Next, I started adding coffee grounds along the rails just to give it some texture and some contrast. If you look in the movie, there's a, a lot of debris sitting on those rails. A little splash of yellowish green there mixed in some red. After that, it dried a little bit. It was still a little too bright. I wanted to blend everything together, so I did another darker wash, a dark brownish gray over everything. I was really happy how this was coming out. I decided to put it back into the uh, cube shelf here and take some pictures, turn on the red lights. You can see that here in a sec. A few more coffee grounds added in there. There you go. So it looks real nice. This is when it was still wet. Obviously I haven't done the floor of the diorama yet. That's what I'm going to work on next. The diorama is set up so that those walls can slide inward and the floor can move. We'll see how that works out. So the next morning, this is what it looked like dried out. You can see I've got the uh, coffee grounds on the wall there. Good variation of color on the sides. I'm really happy how this came out. It looks really good. So stay tuned as I, uh, I'll post more in the future as I work on the floor. Thanks for watching, everybody. May the force be with you.